So in our previous video, I spoke about the launch of two possible devices from the company, the Asus Zenfone 7 and the Zenfone 7 Pro, along with the expected price and few specifications like processor and battery. Well, today we have multiple reports that revealed some of the key specifications of the Asus Zenfone 7. The Chinese publication Mizu have found some of the specs from the kernel source of Asus ROG Phone 3. They both share the similar chipset, as a result, they share the kernel source code too. Firstly, the chipset used in Zenfone 7 is in line with the rumors that is Snapdragon 865, whereas the Zenfone 7 Pro is supposed to get the plus version. Speaking about the display, we have a bad news. The device is set to feature a 6.4 inch panel, which is fine, but it will be LCD panel and not AMOLED. What's more is this is just a 60Hz panel. By now we have come across so many mid-range phones with lower price tag having 120Hz LCD panel. ASUS could have gone at least with OLED 60Hz which would be fine, but this is just unacceptable. That said, because of this 60Hz LCD panel, the price would definitely get affected. The fingerprint reader will either be on the side or on the rear panel. The phone also seems to get a triple slot for two SIM cards and a micro SD card. Coming to cameras, the main camera is based on a Sony IMX686, that is a 64 megapixel sensor that is also used in the ROG Phone 3. Next we have the ultra wide angle camera that has a Sony IMX363 sensor and a time of flight sensor. Overall, the ASUS Zenfone 7 is shaping up to be very similar to the Zenfone 6. Aside from the upgraded chipset and main camera, they are mostly the same. All said, with just few days left for the unveiling of Zenfone 7 series, we don't need to wait too long before we get complete idea about these handsets. So that's it for this video. Thank you for watching and as always, I will catch you guys in the next one.